question. Laurel Maryland is next on our others line. Go ahead. Good morning. Good morning. Um, you know, I, I honestly, I can't vote for anybody that's in the running. I don't believe in war without end, which is apparently what John McCain is advocating. And yet I'm not a peacenik either. But Hillary Clinton, I mean, I honestly, I, I'm no fan of the Clintons, but I don't see how, you know, just a few short years in the Senate and being first lady qualifies her to be the president of the United States. And Barack Obama and this Reverend Wright issue, I, I don't understand why it's not getting more play in the media. I mean, he basically, you know, tossed Reverend Wright to the side, you know, but that's, that's politically, and I don't think anybody really believes that he did that on a personal level. And the Reverend's a racist. And I don't know how you can hang out for 20 years with a racist and not be a racist yourself, you know, if. If you substitute a lot of the reverend's words and, and put black people instead of white people in a sermon, then everybody would realize, hey, the guy's a racist, and anybody that's around him is, you know, damaged goods. But the media apparently just loves Barack Obama, and they're giving him a pass. I mean, if, if there was a, um, <clears throat> excuse me, if there was another candidate and they found out that he was a member of some white supremacist, Christian Identity Church, it would be on the front page every day. It would be on the evening news. It would be on the nightly news. But they're giving him a pass. But the guy's preaching the same stuff that white racists do. Thanks, Laurel. We'll move on to 